As the weather turns from summer to fall, it's time to grab your warm blanket, favorite pumpkin spice drink, and a good book. Melissa with the book break has three recommendations for fall reading lists. Melissa, great to see you. Thank you. I love coming into fall because I always want to just grab a book. So. The first book that we have here is by a Utah author, which we love. Okay, this first one right here. Yes, The okay. Slow March of Light by Heather B. Moore. And Heather is just a veteran writer, and this is a beautiful historical fiction novel. And what I really love about The Slow March of Light is this is about a man who used to live in Logan, from Idaho, used to be a BYU-Idaho professor. Oh, wow. And it takes place during the Cold War. And his name is Bob Inema. And Bob just, he had his life going, and then he was drafted. Next thing you know, he's in Germany. The Berlin Wall hasn't gone up yet. He's over there in East Germany, Soviet occupied as a spy. Okay. And then Berlin Wall goes up, he gets captured, and it's crazy. But that's only one end. The other side is this this amazing woman named Louisa, who is a German, who ends up helping people escape Soviet-occupied East Germany. And they meet, they become friends, and it's just like this heartwarming story that will just keep you turning the pages all night long. Oh, I already want to pick it up. What an amazing story. This yeah. sounds so good. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, so this next one here, Ravages of Honor. So this is one where, you know, it, it takes you into like a dystopian sci-fi world where your main character was kidnapped as a young girl and she was forced to be a soldier. She's now brought over to her homeland and is about to kill someone and realizes oh, it's her brother. And so she recognizes, I can fight. I don't have to do this anymore. I'm gonna save my brother. But it's a big deal to do that. But she's a strong woman, even if she doesn't think she is. That's a twist when you find out that's your brother. Yeah, <laughs> you have yeah. That choice. and fighting yeah. back after not really having a choice. And this one's by Mona Lisa Foster. And it is really gonna just kind of keep you on the edge of your seat. It's action. So like, just be prepared. When you start reading it, you're gonna wanna keep reading it. You won't you know? be able to put it down. Okay, yes. I love it. Okay, what's the last one? Oh, my luck. I gotta tell you like, I have been staying up like all night long going through this series. So this is a four book series called the Twisted Luck series. And the fifth book will come out in the next month or so. Okay. So get started. This is by Mel Todd and it stars a girl named Corey, also known as Corey Catastrophe because she's always stuck in these like crazy things and she <laughs> didn't do anything, you know? But Corey has, you know, she doesn't really have family that's there for her, but she has a chosen family, her best friend. This is in a magical world, but like in our world. So it's an urban fantasy, but it's kind of what I call a slice of life. Okay. You know, where you get to follow this young woman who's just trying to become an EMT, graduate school, and then magic keeps getting in the way. But you know what? She's strong and she's there and she does a great job just engaging you in the world and you just... I mean, all of these, you just can't wait to see what's going to happen next. These are really good picks, Melissa. I want to yeah. read all of them right now. Okay, <laughs> you're also hosting a giveaway. Tell us about that real quick. I am. So really quickly, you can go to my website, thebookbreak.com, and enter to win any of these three books for free. And I will be choosing and announcing the winners Friday morning. So you've got to get in now if you want one. Amazing. Melissa, where can we go for more information? One more time. So thebookbreak.com. And you can find all of these books online. Um, Amazon's probably your quickest, but any bookstore online is great. And you're going to love them. Amazing. The bookbreak.com will tell you more. Now we can cuddle up with a good book with our blanket. Yes. <laughs> Melissa, great yes. to see you. Thank you. Thank you.